hopped on the L train and got off and I got shot too. My mom would have been crying, bro, crying, bro. Protesters rallied outside the 73rd Precinct in Brownsville in the wake of a police-involved subway shooting that left four people injured, including two innocent bystanders. Demonstrators criticized the NYPD's response, arguing that cops should have tried to de-escalate the situation rather than opening fire on the 37-year-old suspect, Darrell Mickles. Hope they do something differently. The shooting happened on Sunday afternoon at the Sutter Avenue L train station. Two officers were on the platform when they saw Mickles enter the station without paying the fare. When they approached him, police say he charged at them with a knife. The confrontation spilled into an oncoming train and then back onto the platform. Both officers drew their weapons and opened fire, hitting Mickles multiple times in the torso. Stray bullets struck a 49-year-old man in the head who is still in critical condition and grazed a 26-year-old woman. Police have confirmed one of the officers was also hit by friendly fire underneath his left armpit. He's expected to make a full recovery. I think that those officers should be commended um, for how they uh, really show the great level of restraint. Mayor Adams defended his officers, referencing body camera video that allegedly shows the two cops repeatedly trying to reason with Mickles, who has 20 prior arrests and a history of mental illness. According to the NYPD, the officers tried to use a taser before drawing their weapons, but failed to subdue the suspect. And he was not shot for fair evasion. He was shot because he had a knife and he went after the police op officers after repeatedly asking him to put down the knife. Nichols was stabilized in the hospital, arrested and charged with attempted assault, menacing criminal possession of a weapon and theft of services. The knife he allegedly used to threaten the officers went missing from the crime scene but was later recovered.